Hi, Brendan here with another episode of Coach Gee TV. In our series, Who's Setting Investors Up to Fail? We're going to step back and we're going to take a look at an industry as a whole. We're going to take a look at the mutual fund industry and how the mutual fund industry sets investors up to fail. Here's a study that was done. The average percentage of U.S. stock funds outperformed by the relative benchmark over a 15-year period ending 2016, 90.5% of the U.S. funds out there, when measured against their benchmark, underperformed uh, the benchmark. So again, if I'm a mutual fund investor, I'm going to hire a mutual fund manager to pick the stocks and ideally outperform the market. Well, overwhelming, overwhelmingly, the mutual fund managers out there are not outperforming their benchmarks. They're underperforming it. Now, how do they set investors up for failure here? Because if I'm going to put my money with the 10% that outperformed the benchmark, how am I going to identify those? I'm going to use their track record. What I'm going to do is take a look at the 5-year, 10-year, 15, 20-year track record, see how they've done in the past, and project into the future that those are going to be the winning funds in the future. Well, it puts me in the position of having to predict the future. I'm trying to speculate about the future. In essence, I'm gambling. And again, when I gamble long term, you go into a casino, you don't come out of there wealthy, you come out of there poor. So again, mutual funds are setting investors up to fail. Again, they're underperforming their benchmark and they're having investors speculate in regards to their track records in terms of who's going to do well in the future. Nobody can predict the future, but that's what they're doing to investors. And again, they're setting investors up for failure. Thank you.